I'm now going to continue my video series on YouTube partner tips with how to find and acquire a gimmick. And you're going to see the importance of this in this particular video. Now one of the biggest challenges that a YouTuber faces is how to cause a subscriber to return to your channel. Sure they may subscribe to your channel, but they may never come back to your channel. Okay? There's no guarantee that once they subscribe to your channel they're ever going to watch any of your videos ever again. So you have to find a way to, to motivate them to come back to your channel over and over again. That's what increases your watch time, your view count, all kinds of other things. See what I mean? Alright, so how are you going to persuade these subscribers? Now keep in mind, they go ahead and they subscribe to your channel. They may continue their subscription with you, but they may never watch your videos. And a lackluster subscriber is not a very good subscriber. It's just like an anchor on a ship. Sure, it's nice to have them around, but if they're not watching your videos, they're not doing very much for you. See what I mean? So one of the best ways to persuade a subscriber to you return to your channel is to have a gimmick. Okay? And if they like your gimmick, they'll return over and over again. Now videotaping parades is one good way to drive your subscribers back to your channel. Okay? Now here's the kick. Not only will parade footage persuade your subscribers to come back to your channel, but if you watch other people's parades and review their parade footage, there's a very good chance that they'll come over to your channel and watch your parades and review your parade footage. And the same is true with the next thing I'm going to bring up. You can also videotape Relay for Life events. Okay? And if you videotape these Relay for Life events, then you can go over and you can watch other Relay for Life events of other uh, channels and then you can uh, let them know that you actually watched their footage and you can let them know what you thought of their footage hopefully it was all good and then they may come over to your channel and start watching yours and review yours as well see what I mean? Now another thing you can do is you can videotape historical landmarks or unusual places in your area as a matter of fact, this spring, when I have all my equipment hooked up, I am going to drive down country roads that nobody has ever seen, unless, of course, they've actually driven down those roads, and I'm going to show you what those roads actually look like, because Google Maps doesn't necessarily show you what these roads look like. They'll show you the main drags, okay? but they may not show you the country roads. I'm going to show you that. And I'm going to entitle that particular video series, The Road Less Traveled. Okay. Now another thing you can videotape is firework displays. Okay. So if you go somewhere and there's fireworks, turn that camera on and videotape it. People love that kind of stuff, especially the infirmed who can't just necessarily go out of their house and watch the fireworks display. Or, let's say you have somebody that has to work that particular night and they missed the fireworks show. Well, they didn't really miss it because you videotaped it. See what I mean? Okay. Now, some organizations will allow you to videotape their events or any signs that they've erected. Okay? Although you won't be able to monetize these particular videos, you can attract attention to your channel with this. And that's a good thing. Because remember, at this stage of the game in YouTube, YouTube watch time is right now more valuable than monetization. Okay? And that's very important. Now, I know you're very anxious to see what I come up with next to help you acquire 
view counts, watch time, critical subscribers, that kind of thing. But you're just going to have to wait because i got some surprises for you. But I do want to thank you very much for watching this particular presentation. I will tell you more in a future video, so I'd like for you to stay tuned.